And the Homeless Alliance is stepping in to make sure hundreds of people don't have to bear this weekend's freezing temperatures. News 9's Angelicia Bruton continues our team coverage with their plan to keep folks warm this weekend. The Homeless Alliance is opening doors to several shelters throughout the weekend. They say with temperatures this low, no one should have to sleep outside. Whenever temperatures are predicted to be below freezing, Dan Strawn with the Homeless Alliance says they implement their cold weather contingency plan. Our day shelter will open with 80 beds on nights where it's forecast to be below 32 degrees. Um, Salvation Army will open uh, 25 overflow beds for women and children. And then on Saturday night, City Rescue Mission will have 50 beds uh, for single adults. Strawn says it's their goal to make sure no one has to spend the night outside to bear the cold weather. Especially for unsheltered homeless people, it's never safe to live outside. Um, but it can be downright dangerous when, when it gets to freezing or below. And, and you know, some of the risks are frostbite and hypothermia. And the Homeless Alliance says they're in a much better spot to care for folks compared to last February's historic snowstorm. Because the shelters were all at reduced capacity and, and nobody could go into overflow, um, we opened the old Willard School as a winter shelter. On the worst night of the February deep freeze, we had 276 people. So um, if the numbers are similar to what they were last winter, we, we, we think we have enough. Shelters will be open at full capacity and COVID protocols will be in place. Strawn says several outreach teams will be driving around town telling people about the overnight services. The addresses for all overnight shelters can be found on our website. In Oklahoma City, Angelicia Bruton, Oklahoma Zone, News 9.